Hi honeys, how are you? Tanya Shylock here and of course Welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I hope that you are fine, amazing, and well. So currently, it's around 8-ish in the morning. I'm just starting my day, and I just want to bring you along. And uh, But before that, if this is the first time you're watching my face over here, hi there, I'm Tanya Nishailok, I'm a Ugandan beauty and lifestyle content creator. Feel free to subscribe, to like, to comment, and to share out with friends and family. And don't forget above all to turn on the notification bell so that you're notified whenever we have a new vlog on the channel. As I've just explained to you, uh, currently it's around 8-ish in the morning. I'm just starting my day. The good thing I'm done with laying my bed. Let me just flip the camera to show you guys. This is how it does look like going on over here. Uh, I actually just changed the pillowcases and I just placed on these brown ones. They are absolutely and absolutely soft and they came with the other bed cover I did show you in the a bedroom tour video. Hopefully guys you have watched that. If you have not yet watched that, I'm going to be leaving it in the description box below. Then for the bed sheets, I'm just having a plain bed sheet. It is from uh, Owino Market, 5,000 Ugandan shillings. Then the upper one, which has those woven flowers that I got as a gift from my mom. Okay, so you guys, actually I'm done with my uh, simple meditation routine and currently I want to just go on to write down some uh, some of my vision notes. And this is one way that I keep myself on track and help myself also to stay intentional, especially when it comes to things I want to accomplish because sometimes when you are all over the place, you cannot actually accomplish anything. In one of my recent vlogs, I did show you this board that I love to write on things that I uh, am actually manifesting or anything like that. Things I want to accomplish, my goals, my plans, all those different things in a particular period of time. So today I'm going to be rubbing off this middle section and probably put in new things. So uh, you guys have been doing a lot of different, you know, uh, writing. I don't want to show everything over here or explain everything over here. But I've been doing a lot of vision notes and, uh, you know, just making sure that my goals and my plans are actually into alignment. And probably I'm also going to be explaining to you how, ma how far it has helped me accomplish a lot of things because when I look back, uh, when I started doing these things of, you know, writing down different vision notes and vision, uh, you know, related things, I was literally not, uh, I had not actually accomplished anything I wanted. Also, this folder going on over here, it has a lot of my vision notes. I actually started writing vision notes and vision boards and uh, manifesting in this form of writing. It was back in 2021. It was back in 2021. So these are all the things that I've been doing over time. And uh, some of them are not yet here, but I'm sure that with time, everything is going to be here. So part of this, it is for 2021, you see even 2020, uh, 2020. Uh, if there is any advice I would give to you when it comes to self-discovery and finding your truest potential and where your true power belongs, there are two different methods I would love to just, you know, recommend in case anyone is interested. The first one is using gratitude and thank you. Then the next one is to uh, use the method of manifestation, probably writing down. And uh, if you're interested in knowing more depth about those two things, you can tell me, then I can probably, you know, incorporate them in some of my vlogs. But to just explain to uh, about them a little bit, when it comes to gratitude, I would advise you to keep a gratitude channel. A lot of things did change for me and the way how I see different things did change for me as soon as I started uh, keeping a gratitude journal and writing at least three to five things I'm grateful for every other day. And then the second thing, guys, uh, it is all about manifestation. And manifestation, I recommend that you manifest through writing down and uh, writing down uh, things that you want in life. Uh, you can write them down and you can be, you know, sometimes visioning them, uh, how that moment would feel like, how that, you know, that day would feel like when you 
uh, or finally have that particular thing you love or you would like, then you let it go. For manifestation, there are only three things. You write down, you vision it, then you let it go. Like you leave it to go and you let God bring it at uh, you know his right time. Then uh, guys, if you use those two things, I'm assured so far the results I've gotten through using those two different you know methods I've just told you about they are magnificent phenomenon and I've been able to you know jump onto this journey of you know self-discovery finding which things I can initially you know plant in my time and they would you know reap me the success along the way so right now i'm going to be writing down uh things that i want to accomplish up for the end of this month and yeah i actually am also thinking about going back home like my main parents house and the main reason why i'm i feel or i think not think or no feel but the main reason why i am going back home it's because there is one of my distant relatives who actually lives in london uh, she has lived in london for the longest time ever she has lived in the uk for the longest time ever she's actually a friend of our family she's a family friend uh, she's a nurse you know, she went in uh, the United Kingdom back in the 1980s, I believe. And she has grown old from there. She's a citizen by now. So she's coming over and uh, to our main parents' house uh, to visit us, to do all those particular things that we love doing as Africans. And I want to be amongst the ceremony. So I might also bring you along when I'm moving there. I'm going to be cleaning this particular studio. I'll just give you a spin. Everything is almost everywhere. That is the truth. You know, accept that table going on over there. Anyway, someone has just banged the door. But anyway, guys, uh, I'm going to be cleaning up after doing my to-do list. Then I want to do a mini haul of some utensils I did get from my big sis. I talked about this in the last vlog, and I think I'm going to be doing it in this particular vlog. How can I realize my potential more fully? That's a question I still ask myself, especially when contemplating what's next in my life. In every job I've taken, in every city in which I've lived, I've known that it's time to move on when I've grown as much as I can. Making a bold move is the only way to advance toward the grandest vision the universe has for you. If you allow it, fear will completely immobilize you. Finally, I'm done. As you see going on over here, this is what I'm wearing. I'm just done with breakfast right now. I'm actually rushing out. It's already 3. And the party that I told you about in the morning, it was meant to start at 3. So I'm already past some few minutes, but I'm going to solve that with a border border right. And uh, before I move out, actually, I want to do a mini haul of all the cuts rally I did get from my big sis. Uh, this is the package, uh, the box that everything came in. So I'm going to be going through them, hopefully one by one. But let me first set up the camera real quick. First thing, they are these glasses. I'm not going to get out all of them, but hopefully I'll just show you how they do look like. This is how they do look like. They're in two different shapes. And also this. And this, there are actually four of them. Yes, they are four. The other thing, they are these storage containers going on over here. 
hopefully you can see them very well they are only three and they have this amazing uh, set where they do sit on so that is the second thing i did get from her i did get some plates uh i got two of these ones which actually are like balls uh like a bakuli this is how all of them do look like so these are the uh the storage containers then these are the balls see right now uh, I'm finally done with everything. I'm going to just tidy up a little bit and uh, I'm planning to meet up with my cousin at a particular location so that we can continue from there to the main location. So good evening guys, once again, finally I'm back home and uh, it has been such an amazing day and uh, we just enjoyed the party. She was so happy. I did not vlog a lot. I was just trying to keep everything minimal and uh, you know, not make people uncomfortable through actually recording them. But either way, it was such an amazing day. I reached there, we, I met up with my cousins, with my long-term friends, you know, people I've not seen in a while. And we just chatted and we had an amazing time. But uh, this brings it to the end of the vlog. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, to like, to comment, and to share out with friends and family. And let me meet you in my next one. Tanya Shylock switching out. Bye for now.